Hey guys, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a simple light mechanism in Rust. A lot of you may not know how to make a light mechanism, so that's what I'm here to teach you. And bloody hell, that is a nice looking base. So, let's just go all the way somewhere nice over here. Now nah, that's built on. Okay, let's just do it here. So, all we need to do... Ah, so building. Come on, man. There you go. God's sake. Let's do that. <laughs> There's nowhere we can build, man. Right here, yeah. God's sake, I swear, building block. Server needs to be wiped. Okay, here's good. Let's just get this simple thing going for us, right? So to get a light going, um, all we're going to be needing is a ceiling light, which I'm sure at least 90% of you have actually seen on the clip. If you're new to Rust, maybe not. They're really common to find. I don't know how you would have actually seen one. Get this all armoured. Get a TC going for us. is a ceiling light it's gonna load ceiling light which is really cheap to make 50 metal fragments I don't think it's default BP but you think you need to research it see the ceiling light and wire which is default BP it's only five high quality metal and you get one foot and one foot is a lot it's gonna get that much just in case and any power source such as a windmill a windmill. It's not coming up, I don't know why. There it is. Wind turbine, okay. Windmill, but the most common one you're going to find is a solar panel. So you get a solar panel, only 25 high quality. Really easy to find, just get a few of those, because why not? You don't need that many, but you need one actually. Let's say we've got a. So where's the light? The sun's over there. Just face it that way, get the most power as possible. There. There. Okay, what we need to do is just pull this up really quick. It's gonna make it metal hands just for the sake of the video. So you see, all we have is this wire and this. Just pop down the roof, maybe I don't know. Over, let's see. I don't know the to do a wall there for you able to see what the light actually does. So that's why we're doing this. Now that we have a roof and solar panels down, let's, let's just pretend this box here. You wouldn't need to build this if you already have a base going for you. I suspect you already do have a base going for you. All of this doesn't really matter what grade it is. We need some uh, light source like this, wire, as you see we have here, um, and a ceiling light to actually just get a light going, or any other type of light you find. Let's say we place, let's get some more ceiling lights actually going. Ceiling. So let's place a ceiling like here, ceiling like here, ceiling here, here, and over here. So all you're going to need to do is just get your light, hover over until you see this one which says electrical output. You click on that with the wire, you just jack the wire like that. You do it need to, not, it doesn't really matter, you can walk through the wires. You can't break them though, just saying. So to get rid of a wire, yeah, all you do is you hover over the thing you first started and right click it hold right click on it it's gonna let, there you go and it's all cleared so let's just do that real quick and then this to clear it just to go over again it's gonna clear man I swear 
There you go. So I kind of want to do this a bit neat. So let's just go across here like that. So all we need to do, it doesn't matter how you do it, it can be unneat or not. You just drag it to the first light like this. There you go. So we're getting energy from here, which is collecting into that light. And from there, we click this again, which is the output. We just drag it across here until we see this again. We click this again, just where the uh, output is, as you can see. Go to the light, and it doesn't really matter which way you do it. Just hope you have enough power to do it in the first place, actually. I can't see it, there it is. Do that now, do that, that. Okay, so we've got our simple light mechanism going on for us here. Let's say, let's click this up so you can see this light. Got the same man. Look, um, it's pretty useful. Another thing you can do if you don't have is just do a large battery here. Actually, what the hell's a search light? Even though this is a thing. I know, you don't need to. I'm trying to find different light source. So this large, I didn't know that's a thing. So let's just search up the light. I swear there was more that you can use, and no, there isn't. Okay, now we're going to be doing doors. So all we need is a um, door, a door controller. Let's just do a switch now for just the sake of it, just a standard switch. Okay, there you go. So now we've got that. Demolish, demolish, demolish. So all we need for a door, just put a doorway here. And it's one wall over here. Okay, so what we need is for us to grab a door. Let's grab our door here. Doesn't matter which way it is. Um, put our door controller right next to it, or our door pairer. So it's all paired to the door. But for it to actually pair to the door, we need to open this, we need to unlock it, and then we click pair. If it is locked, it won't pair. So then after you unlock it, you can just lock it. One, 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 one. Lock, and then it's still paired. But first, if you want to pair in the first place, unlock your door really quick. From here, all you need to do is just pop down the switch. You can do it with lasers, pressure plates, anything. It's really simple. Grab your wire. Go to a solar panel. Click there. Go through the bottom one, which is the turn on. Come out of the output. Then go straight to your door controller. There's only one you can put it in here. So from that, look, from that, all it is is simple wire. Do this, door opens, do that, door closes. If you really want to, you can make a laser, you can do like a low wall here, place a laser, so every time you walk through the laser, it opens and put a timer, so every uh, two seconds after you go through the door, it will close. It's really simple, electricity isn't anything hard, it seems complicated, but trust me, it really isn't, and... Oh, let's do this actually, see what it looks like. <laughs> oh, that's sick actually. And yeah, thank you for watching this video. I hope you've learned um, quite a bit about electricity from my video. Uh, if you like, if you want to see any more tutorials such as Rust tutorials, CS tutorials, any video game tutorial, um, just leave it in the comments, I guess, and I will pretty much 100% see it actually. Because I don't have a large fan base at the moment, I hope I will have it. But what can you do, I guess? Um, that's how to make simple light and door mechanism in Rust and base suite base.